Hello and welcome students to Anupal Sir's video classes. In this video, I will discuss some important thing regarding aromatic compounds, especially aromatic electrophilic substitutions reactions, in which it includes friedel crafts alkylation, acylation, nitration, halogenation, all these things. Okay, so let's start. In friedel crafts reaction, we have benzene ring. It will react with Rx part and obviously anhydrous AlCl3 should be given. I will tell you the reason why anhydrous condition is maintained. Then benzene ring will form an alkyl group and byproduct HCl, HX, AlCl3 are there. Okay. So in this case, AlCl3 as aluminium has 13 the atomic number we know so it has a vacant 3d orbital in this vacant 3d orbital x can donate its electron and it can form rx plus aluminium has accept so therefore al minus so this x will attract the electrons from this r group and it will have a partial positive charge here so this to neutralize this partial positive charge benzene will attack and it will form R. So X AlCl3 is there and this X minus X portions will attack to gain the re-aromatic CT part because benzene ring is aromatic we know 4n plus 2 electron pi electron system closed figures so Huckel's rule of aromaticity it is maintained and the product will be obtained that also will have aromatic because aromatic compounds are very very stable it does not have a tendency to remove its aromaticity very easily so it can form these portions so this is known as friedel cats alkylation now come to the friedel cats acylation part and then we need to compare which one is much better method so friedel crafts acylation we have benzene ring here we have RCOX AlCl3 obviously anhydrous conditions it will form COX part okay COR part okay acyl group is there so it is known as friedel crafts acylation now what is happening here RCOX will donate again its electrons then RCO X plus and AL minus again it will attract the electrons from this carbon and the positive charge will be developed on the head of this carbon and this benzene ring will attack and this bond is broken down so again the last step is the aromatization step sorry last step is the aromatization step COR part is there and here the X ALCL3 minus this X will take this hydrogen and it will form again aromatic compound COR so why acylation is better method than alkylation because in this case we know this is minus R effect okay and benzene ring contains three pi bonds that means it has a nucleophilic property it can donate its lone pair to any other electron seeking that means it is nucleophilic in nature so in this case if it attracts the electron density from benzene ring that means it decreases the electron density that means it makes the ring electron deficient that means it makes the ring more uh, inactive part so it is ring deactivator minus r effects are ring deactivator towards electrophilic substitution why it is called electrophilic substitution because benzene ring acts as nucleophile that is why a electrophile comes so it is known as electrophilic substitutions okay one hydrogen is getting replaced but in case of acylation what we will get our product we will get our product like this but this R group has the plus I effect so due to this plus I effect the 
electron donating capacity of benzene ring will be increased so it is ring activated therefore what is forming here this portion when again form then further attack can take place that means polyalkylation in case of alkylation chances of polyalkylation may take place okay if we give here benzene and rx and al cl3 anhydrous condition that we don't have any guarantee that one r group is entered here that more and more r group can be entered due to the polyalkylation part so it is very very disadvantageous method so friedel crafts acylation is much better method than friedel crafts alkylation okay this concept is clear and the second disadvantage is that that is rearrangement may take place why rearrangement may take place because in benzene ring if we give here propyl chloride and anhydrous alcl3 anhydrous condition is maintained anhydrous alcl3 is given then the expected product is what the expected product is ch2 ch2 ch3 but in this case rearrangement take place because when this carbocation is formed after the first step chlorine is donated electrons to alcl3 and after the first step when this carbocation is formed then it is 1 degree then it will shift one hydrogen to form ch3 ch ch3 plus charge so it is 2 degree now it's become more stable we know due to plus i effect you can see my videos lecture on basic fundamentals where i have discussed the stability of carbocation stability of carbocations that 2 degree carbocation is more stable than 1 degree and then this benzene ring attack and the last step aromatization take place and the product expected that is propyl but actually this is not obtained as major product this is obtained as major product that is cumin or isopropyl benzene so friedel crafts alkylation has two disadvantage namely polyalkylation and namely rearrangement may take place okay next we come to the halogenation part that is also under friedel crafts friedel crafts like mechanism aromatic electrophilic substitutions but the question is why anhydrous alcl3 is used because if water is used in this method then before the donation of this rx part water molecule can donate its lone pair that is why our original reaction of friedel crafts will be hampered before the donation water molecule may also have a chance to donate its lone pair so this is not a viable one that is why the alcl3 part should be dry condition or it should be absence of any water molecule next portion is that that is when halogenation is done if we give here benzene cl to fecl3 or br to febr3 then what is happening one chlorine atom will be there the mechanism is like just like friedel crafts because chlorine also here have lone pairs fecl3 so it can form cl plus fecl3 minus and it will take the electrons then benzene ring will attack and again it will form aromatization this chlorobenzene so again one electrophile comes and hydrogen is getting replaced or substituted that is why it is known as aromatic electrophilic substitutions next we have nitration under this mechanism we also have nitration that is benzene ring is there and we have here concentrated hno3 and concentrated h2so4 we will have here no2 group okay so we need to know the mechanism otherwise we don't understand that what is the role of h2so4 here it can also a question based on this concept here nitric acid we have the structure like this so 
between sulfuric acid and nitric acid sulfuric acid is more stronger acid so it can donate its H plus to this so here it becomes O minus it becomes OH2 plus and this O minus can donate lone pair H2 will be eliminated NO2 plus is generated because nitrogen can form four hands O minus comes H2 eliminated so NO2 plus electrophile and then this benzene ring will attack to this aromatization again I have shown this mechanism aromatization so you will get the product that is NO2 nitrobenzene again it is the example of aromatic electrophilic substitutions okay now the question is given here it is very much common question that why aniline is not used as solvent in friedel crafts reaction because we use solvent which don't hamper our original reaction but aniline what may happen aniline may also have any plaster effect we know so it can increase the activity of benzene ring and therefore this benzene ring can also attack to the alcl3 part or the lone pair may also attack to the alcl3 part that means aniline is ring activator so we can't use here any ring activator substance because it can hamper our original friedel crafts reactions okay but at the same time why nitrobenzene is used as solvent the question is given why nitrobenzene can be used as solvent because nitrobenzene has which type of effect it is minus r effect because nitrogen has positive charge so it decreases the electron density so the benzene ring of nitrobenzene is very much inactive that is why nitrobenzene can act as solvent here no plus r effect can be used as solvent here Okay, so this type of things are very very important regarding your aromatic electrophilic substitution part. In the competitive level, this type of questions are given, that is, this type of questions are given like that. Two rings are there and it is known as phenyl benzoid. If it is marked as A, if it is marked as B, then mixed acid is there, concentrated HNO3, concentrated H2SO4, then what will be the product? We will have four options, what will be the product? That means is A ring is more active than B ring. Why? Because this group has minus R effect. So it can decrease the electron density of benzene ring. So it is ring deactivator. That is why this benzene ring does not have that ability to donate its electron. But in this case, oxygen has got positive a plus R effect. So it activates the benzene ring and this electron can be donated to the NO2 plus. I have already shown in my earlier portions. So the product will be ortho and para but ortho position due to sterically hindered the major product will be in the para position so this type of questions mechanism related questions are very very important from this part okay so to get more videos don't forget to subscribe and if you think that it is to be liked and shared so please share as much as you can thanks for watching